Hi everyone, welcome to Wig Studio One. My name is Christy. I'm Wigging with Christy on Instagram and YouTube, and I'm one of the reviewers for the Wig Studio One team. Today I'm bringing you a review of the Calabasas wig in the Crushed Almond Blonde R color. So Calabasas is part of the New Beltrus City Collection, now available on wigstudio1.com. Now, this wig was sent to me by wigstudio1.com for the content and the video of this wig. However, this is my own thoughts and opinions. Calabasas has no permatease. I do not feel any throughout this piece. It feels low density, um, maybe a sliver over the low, but to me, it really feels like low density. It does lift off the face for me pretty nicely as well. It has a layer here in the front on both sides and like a gradual layer, like a curtain bang, although it's not a center part. Uh, but then it goes into a kind of long bob with a little bit of layering in here as well. Again, this is made with heat-friendly fiber, so you'll want to apply heat to maintain it. It will start to feel crunchy around the ends as normal with heat-friendly fibers, so it does require heat to straighten back that out or use a curling iron and smooth those fibers to feel soft again. Again, there's no permatees and it is a low density wig. It has an extended lace front and a left monofilament part. Beautiful color with this crushed almond blonde. What I love about this color is that the root is not really dark. I think many of you that are looking for a light rooted blonde is going to like this color. I think this opens up the spectrum of clients looking for a blonde with not too dark of a root. Let's go ahead and do a spin. We'll take a look at this outside. We'll take a look inside the cap and the color, and then we'll do some styling and final thoughts. Okay, so let's take a look at this color, Crushed Almond Blonde R color. Now there's been lots of questions about which bell truss is this most similar to, and I've looked at the color codes on all the wigs, and there is no identical color. Uh, we do not have descriptions yet for these colors from the manufacturer, but in looking in the color codes, the color code they give for Crushed Almond Blonde R is 141701 plus 18. So they're saying that that root is actually an 18 root, which would be the same rooting as a Palm Springs Blonde by John Renault. The 17 and a 101 is an ashy blonde, platinum that we see in, and also in Palm Springs Blonde. But this has that 14 that is going to bring in that warmth. So this is a neutral color in my opinion. It could go cool or have that little bit of a warmth in there. I like to see more of the cool, but definitely a neutral color that pulls both. So what is your thoughts on Calabasas? She's a cute basic style that I think a lot of you are gonna like because you can put it away from your face and have still some layering and kind of lifting there, but also she can easily go into a ponytail half up. You can do you know, a lot with her. She's that cute little style. I almost think that she's like the straight version of the Laguna uh, Beach wig. And I have that in the dark brown highlight color and that review is on the Wig Studio One channel as well. So this is like very sister styles to me, easy to interchange them. Obviously, probably if you straighten Laguna Bleach, it's gonna be longer than this, but it's kind of like that same length. So one wavy, one straight. This feels very natural, very lightweight, and just kind of moves very easy. Let us know what your thoughts are on this piece down below if you expand the description box of this video. You can leave us a comment, uh, but in that description box, you will see where you can connect with us on Facebook. Wig Studio One Wig and Topper Support Group is our private Facebook group, but we have a Facebook page and Instagram page, as well as links to myself, Wig with Christy, and all the other reviewers for the Wig Studio One team. We'd love to connect with you. If you need further support, you can reach out to support at wigstudio1.com. Have a great day.